Hello again, RIT alumni and friends. This has been an extraordinary month in the world of science, and I'm so proud to say that RIT played a pivotal role in a monumental breakthrough. Our researchers were on the team that proved Albert Einstein's general theory of relativity was right. For the first time, scientists have observed ripples in the fabric of space-time called gravitational waves, arriving at the Earth from a cataclysmic event in the distant universe. This confirms Einstein's predictions a century ago and opens an unprecedented new window onto the cosmos. I hope you will join me in celebrating the amazing accomplishments of the faculty and students, both undergraduate and graduate, in our Center for Computational Relativity and Gravitation, who played a major role in the monumental discovery. This is just one of many research projects conducted at RIT. Today, I'm in the Chester F. Carlson Center for Imaging Science. It's where RIT launched its first PhD program in 1990. Our Imaging Science PhD program was the first of its kind in the nation. And since that time, we've added seven more interdisciplinary doctoral programs. The growth in our PhD programs has resulted in a change in our classification from a master's university to a doctoral university. And this is a very recent change designated by the Carnegie Classification of Institutions of Higher Education and signals our growing national prominence in applied research in countless disciplines. Last year was our most productive year of research on record. We secured $62 million in funding, an increase of 18% from the year before. This is very promising news as student-centered research is one of the central pillars of our greatness through different strategic plan. Yet another exciting new research development at RIT involves the merger of optics, photonics, imaging, and microelectronics. RIT is helping to lead the development of a national photonics center here in Rochester called the American Institute for Manufacturing Integrated Photonics, or AIM Photonics. This interdisciplinary research could impact everything from supercomputers to healthcare to telecommunications. AIM Photonics is one of seven institutes set up by the White House and the Department of Defense to advance the nation's manufacturing capabilities. And in addition to AIM Photonics, RIT is actually a partner on three others in the area of flexible electronics, additive manufacturing, and digital manufacturing. And even with all of our recent research success, RIT is still looking to the future. The university is making million dollar investments in its researchers who are addressing a number of critical societal needs in areas including advanced photonics, healthcare technology, cybersecurity, and remote sensing with unmanned aerial vehicles. We believe that these research areas have a great deal of potential to attract additional corporate and government funding. And while RIT will maintain its focus on a quality, career focused education for our students, we are certainly making significant progress in also establishing RIT as a leading student-centered research university. Thank you again for watching.